Jury selection began today in the murder and conspiracy trial of alleged crime boss Michael Miskey and Associates on charges that date back years. Whoever is picked is in for a long haul. They're coming to the federal courthouse in waves of 10 at a time. Men and women from all walks of life, many from the neighbor islands, summoned for jury duty in one of Hawaii's most complex federal criminal trials, that of Michael Miski, his half-brother, John Stansel, and Delia Fabro Miski, Miski's business associate and widow of Michael's deceased son. In a high publicity case, you have some extra questions. And the first question is, what is it that you've heard about this case in the media or from your friends or from social media, things like that. The second question is, can you put aside all of the things that you've heard and still be fair and impartial? Jury selection or voir dire is being handled with one-on-one -on -one questioning of 20 minutes at a time by both the prosecution and the defense rather than as a pool. If somebody starts talking about what they've heard about the case, um, that becomes more information to everybody else who's listening and makes it that much more difficult to pick a fair and impartial jury. It's expected to take days just to seat the 12 jurors and six alternates needed. They're reporting to the courthouse in batches of 10 each morning and afternoon. This morning's first set had one no-show due to an inter-island travel mix-up. Out of the six men and three women in the first panel, four were excused for reasons ranging from too big a burden on their small business to psychiatric treatment or potential bias. You also want to be able to think about um, whether there's any challenges going on in somebody's life that's going to make it, um, that's going to prevent them from being able, being able to make a fair and impartial decision. Those picked for the job are in for a marathon. Trial is expected to run four to six months with a one week break in March. Jurors from the neighbor islands will get to go home on weekends. Why so long? The scope of the trial is beyond even the other recent high profile federal cases with three defendants remaining after several others reached plea deals in exchange for witness testimony. The defendants are up on 22 counts, including murder for hire, conspiracy connected to the disappearance of Jonathan Frazier, a former friend of Miski's son. There are more than 900 witnesses and thousands of exhibits in evidence. I think without question, whenever you have an organized crime case, and there's so few that happen here in Hawaii, um, that is going to involve a lot of complex data. So whether it's a lot of paperwork that ties in or connects uh, the dots that the, for the prosecution, um, or whether or not it's a lot of witnesses. The organization of all of that so far is not up to snuff with the judge. The judge scolding attorneys today at a pretrial conference ahead of jury selection, saying we are far from getting off on the right foot on both sides. A defense attorney said, I apologize. The court had to wake up this morning and come to an S show. Another defense colleague saying, it's an S show, I know it. The judge responded using the full expletive, saying, you call it an S show, I'll call it an expletive show, and that's what it is. Disappointing does not even convey it. Both sides have a little time to get their exhibit indexes in order and smooth out jury instruction drafts the judge also took issue with. Trial is expected to begin within weeks of the end of jury selection.